Hello everybody, Jonathan Doucette, St. Albert Dodge, showcasing a fresh trade. 2020 around 1500 Laramie, just under 45,000 K. Appreciate everyone checking out the detailed walk around video of this truck. As you can see up front, beautiful chrome appearance group. Tow hooks in there with the, with the chrome bumpers, you can actually have a tow, uh, tow hook. LED headlights, when you're traveling down the road at night, they are amazing. They light up the sides of the road. You can see deer or sh wherever coming from the, any angles. Um, as you can see, it's lifted up quite a bit. That isn't a lift kit. It's actually the air suspension. So there's two off-road modes. This is off-road two, which is the highest. Off-road one, and then you have uh, normal drive height, which I'll sh we'll show you afterwards. And then entry exit mode and aerodynamics. So this is on the highway from normal mode, it'll actually drop down into aero mode, about an inch and a half, inch and a quarter, and give you a better, lower, smaller profile to help your fuel economy. But on your key fob, you have unlock and lock, remote tailgate release, which I'll show you in a moment, and then remote start, of course, and then your, your entry exit mode. So I'm gonna double push that. And you can see it dropping down. So that's super handy if you're headed, coming out of the grocery store and drop that down. It'll actually go right down until you, almost touches the wheel wells on top of the tires. Just helps getting in and out of the truck a lot easier. Very, very cool. Fixed side step, you know, with the aero mode, you almost don't even need this to just jump in. But this particular truck does have the RAM box. So when you unlock your main key, um, it'll unlock these as well too. So you have a 400 watt inverter in here. So you have a household plug-in. Lots of possibilities with that. And then back here, I don't want to hit the camera lady, but we can remote drop the tailgate. And this will come down and you have your easy access to your bed. So you have a bed divider. So you have tie downs, which are positional, and then you can put this bed divider in and you can actually, obviously, of course it's not hooked up, but you can have it so this will come around and give you some extra extension here as well too under your bed and then divide it cargo. So if you have your, maybe some water totes up front and some other camping gear in behind, you can, you can do that. Very easy to lift tailgate, backup camera, seven way plug in, four way plug plus your hitch, ready to tow. It's got a brake controller, all sorts of cool stuff. We'll jump in up front and uh, go over some of the stuff in the rear seat. Back here, as you can see, lots of space, probably the biggest cab of any truck market on the market. Um, beautiful flat floor, no hump. They've raised the cab up and done some neat things back here, extended it back so your, your hump actually ends right here for your, your transmission. Completely flat floor, like I said, these guys actually come, come up and give you tons of storage space. If you don't need this little pocket here, you can get some more space by bringing this up. I'll show you here, or it makes a great uh, storage if you want to carry a little toolbox or something like that, or an extra jack. Um, these seats are reclining too in the back, so there's the handles right here. Push the handles up and then kind of slide your butt forward, and this actually reclines back. Very, very luxurious, very handy. Um, yeah, and you have a 115 volt inverter here as well, too. Another plug in here, so three plugins total, round box. One here and then one in the center console, which I'll show you in a moment. So in these Ram pickup trucks, there's tons of adjustability with the driver's area. You have telescopic and tilt steering. And of course the 10-way power adjustable seat, very handy. Foot on the brake, push button start, as long as your keys in your pocket or somewhere near here, it'll fire right up. Have automatic headlights, so they'll come on and um, work whenever you need to. Same thing with automatic high beams, as long as it's engaged, then it'll, uh, it'll turn on, turn off whenever it's darker, have headlights coming at you, it'll turn off and then turn back on on a dark road. Heated seats, ventilated seats up front, so buttons are on here. Heated steering wheel, of course. And then also too, it's really neat, if it's four degrees and cooler, your heated seat will come on. If it's 26 degrees and above, your ventilated seat will come on just on the driver's side. If you don't like that, you can turn it off, but tons of customization through here, Sirius XM, Apple CarPlay, um, plug in your phone, project your apps onto your screen. You can use your navigation from your phone on here. It's very, very handy to have. Um, all voice control too. Here is your air suspension switch. So right now it's on entry exit. It tells you what mode you're in up here on the, on the gauge cluster. Just push it up to go up and down to go down. So right now we're raising up. We're gonna go to, uh, I believe, aero mode, which 
won't let you drive like that as soon as you start to drive it'll it'll go up but this would be the height that we were at if you're traveling on the highway to give you better fuel economy and then normal mode um would just be where you want to have a day-to-day -day. and then off-road you have to be going under a certain speed otherwise it'll lower you so you don't become unstable parking sensors front and rear and then you have your built-in brake controller pretty handy this has got the the off-road package as well too so um, in addition to four auto four high and four low four auto just engages when it needs to and then four high and four low are, are what they are you actually have an axle lock as well too so you can rock, lock your rear axles if you get stuck or if you want to go through some more treacherous conditions off-road um, the rear axle can lock and both your tires will spin the exact time exact same as opposed to one spinning maybe faster than the other if it was in mud versus trapped in some sand so help you get out of some sticky situations for sure um, great great storage the ram engineers really did an amazing job on this truck it's truck of the year three years in a row 19 20 and 21 um, great functionality cup holders everywhere there's doors for your waters centers for your coffees back here for people in the back plus uh, i didn't even showcase but there's a cup holder right in the center back there the dual glove box very handy very handy um tons to go over i could probably spend an hour talking about this truck i don't think we have enough video length on that but alpine stereo system um leather everywhere leather on the doors the dash very very soft touch surfaces everywhere very premium feeling come down take a look give me a shout on my personal cell 780-952-3018 hope to see you soon